Hey y'all, thanks for stopping in. Appreciate you taking time out of y'all's busy schedule. Stop in and see what it is I'm up to. It is Saturday, the 6th of May, 2023. And I thought I would show a little kit that I carry in the door pocket of my daily driver. This started out as a pocket carry. I made this several years ago. I don't carry things in my pockets very much anymore. And so it ended up down in the door pocket. And it's gone through several iterations of what's inside of it. But we'll go ahead and show you what's in this one today. Uh, I have a modified mini BIC. And this has all kinds of stuff in it. Uh, cotton. Vaseline drenched cotton, uh, little matches, uh, gorilla tape. <laughs> I'll, I'll put a link to the, to the video on that uh, down in the description box. This is just a little flashlight. It helps when you're, you know, like right there at the car or whatever. Um, it's easy enough to just grab it up and, and look around. Instead of turning on the dome light or what have you. Uh, let's bring this down here a little bit. Let's see what I can do here. Just that. There we go. Where are we? Okay. So this. Is a coupon. Well, kind of a coupon. I actually made this from the handle of a razor. Um, not one that I've ever used. But uh, then it's got a, a pull hook on it. These little knurly knobbed keychain things, I've gotten several of them. I got them from Home Depot. I got them off of Amazon. Uh, I'm not crazy about them. They, they tend to come apart, and then your keys end up all over the place. Uh, if you're fortunate, it's all over the inside of the, the car. If you're not as fortunate as you go to pull this off, uh, you know, out of your pocket or whatever, uh, the keys scatter all the way across the parking lot. So I don't use that for keys any longer, but it works nicely in here. And then this is a Gerber. I don't know, it's a little stiff. I don't know the model. Some of y'all may, some of y'all are more into that kind of stuff. Uh, I don't, I can barely remember my own name, let alone knives and whatnot. It's got 1660213B on it, if that makes a difference. If it'll focus. Focus, focus. Not going to focus. Crazy phone. Anyway, just a nice little knife. It's got a serrated edge to it. I'm not real crazy about serrations, but they're almost always sharp. So, or sharp enough to do what you need to do. To do. It's just a nice little knife. And then... This is the Gerber clutch. Focus, focus, focus. Not going to focus. Um, it's got a little piece of cord on it. This is from a blind, you know, window blind. Uh, this stuff burns extremely well. It burns extremely, yeah, extremely well. Catches fire easily. And it burns for a while. It's some sort of waxed nylon or something. I don't know. Maybe it's just nylon. But, uh, and then this little multi-tool's got a nice little pair of pliers on it. This thing does not want to focus tonight. I've got a problem with these with small multi tools. They always pinch me. That one I didn't at that point. So I mean, you can look through, look up 
the Gerber clutch and find, you know, it's got all kinds of neat little stuff in it. Comes in handy during various parts of the day or whatever. So, I don't know, this is saying blade. And the other side's got, oh, okay, it, it basically tells you what is on there, I guess. That's the, the nail file. I probably should go ahead and use that. Then I wouldn't be able to get these little tools out, a little... Uh, Phillips screwdriver and then a can opener with a straight blade I think they could have done more in that space than put what's on the side but it is what it is so this needs to get put back kind of a certain way I had to put this on because I couldn't I couldn't get the the little tool out after it got put in there. And this goes in. And like I said, this will just get dropped in the door pocket of the truck. So this kit this little thing is can be used for self-defense. It can be used as a uh, when you when you're you know when you're making a knot or whatever um, multiple uses but anyway oh excuse me let me know what you think folks give me a thumbs down thumbs up leave me a comment wherever did y'all leave comments on your internet access device of choice if you'd like to share me around your social media that'd be fantastic go check me out on facebook or instagram i'll get links in the description box wherever that is, or your device of choice. you also find links to similar videos. I'll put the link to this uh, lighter down there. Uh, all that, you know, all that good stuff. You'll find my email, my snail mail, um, all the things that keeps YouTube happy. So if your loved ones are nearby, give them a kiss and a hug. If they ain't, give them a call. Hit them up on Facebook. Let them know you think about them. Let them know you love them. We ain't promised tomorrow, people. We ain't promised our next breath. Until I see y'all again, I hope you have a fan day. Slotchy, y'all.